G'day everyone, I'm the Hot Hobbit and welcome back to our Terraria mode let's play. Uh, I'm not really sure what to do, uh, there are tons of zombies around and they are very very painful to deal with. Uh, I, I already got killed by one I was just, well, as I was just sort of preparing for this video. But we still need to do a lot more progression because we at the moment basically have nothing. Uh, I'll just put my armor back on. So in terms of making stuff, I feel like making some iron armor if we can would be a very, very good idea. Looks like we can only make a helmet at the moment, though. So, ah, what the, what the heck is that? What, where, 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 where since when were there ghosts? What, 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 when did that happen? What, I don't, I've never experienced that before. Huh? I mean, that's, that's, that's certainly an intro. Um, Fallen Star, please. Okay. Uh, no, th they jumped. Okay, well, zombies are definitely smarter than I remember. Uh, I might as well just wait until daytime comes around and then we'll come back. Ah, that's a little bit better. So, back in the daytime now. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what we're going to do, but we definitely need a lot more resources. So, I have a feeling our best option would be to go back into another cave. Uh, I have a feeling probably the best one to go down would probably not be this one here, but actually um, the one slightly more to our left. Because I remember we found that last episode just briefly, so maybe we'll find something nice down here. And we found a chest, so... Umbrella? That's not actually too bad. Oh, it's a melee weapon now. Wait, really? Yes! Oh my goodness, that's actually really cool. <laughs> Sorry, it, it, always, it, it always used to not be a melee weapon, but we've got another chest too. Uh, Wonder Sparkling, oh, that's actually quite nice. Uh, we're definitely going to put that on our hotbar. And also, a can of worms. Oh, we got some bait, excellent. So, let's see. What else will, did we find down here? Because there's probably a lot of stuff which I haven't... Ex oh! Oh, it just links up. Well, that's actually quite handy, I suppose. So, we might as well see what's down here, because we didn't see this before and hello worm I do hear you there you are now come here I, I want to deal with you earlier than later because I'm hoping you're not going to do masses of damage that obviously doesn't help me just jumping straight down there you are 21 okay so you do do a decent amount of damage where are you come back okay well I set on fire uh, and it's there we go. Ah. Honestly, as much as I hate dealing with worms, they're, they're still really nice enemies. Uh, we're just going to get this um, iron here, and then we'll just sort of continue down downwards, I think. And, of course, I just get taken out by like slime not even five minutes later. What on earth is that? Wait, what? I, uh huh? An angry dandelion. Wait, since when have been? What, huh? Ah oh dear. Well, um, we're gonna take you out if we can. Uh, probably from afar. Let's see. Can I get my aim on on point? Not quite. There we go. <laughs> I do not want to do with you. Although it did look like you dropped something, possibly. Ah, just coins. Never mind. Okay, so back to where we are, and this yellow slime is still here, Hi there. just continuously taunting us. So we're just going to take him out from afar, just because it's going to be a lot more beneficial. Um, is that a massive chunk of silver? It does look like it. Oh, that is going to be very handy. Um, let's just grab all of this and we'll just all continue onwards. So that's all it did lead us down a little bit. Uh, I don't particularly want to dig through tons of tons of water, but I did see a small cave. Well, it looks like I am now. Thanks a lot, Worm. Oh, for goodness sake. Uh, this, could, this could be... Uh, this could be... Um, dangerous. Uh, let's just... Uh, Let's just get some rope, just in case. Can we use our Wonder Sparkling uh, underwater? Oh, is that a huge portion of gold? Oh, that's very useful. Uh, let's just create a few sticky bombs. Yeah, just throw them there. Hopefully not die. There we go. 
Also draining the water. And it looks like there's more iron as well. So let me just grab that too. You know, I should really just stop jinxing, jinxing myself when it comes to this. So back where we were, uh, I just found a lot of silt, which we're going to grab a lot of because if we do find a... Um, well, well, I can't remember what they're called. Um, I guess the slush nature or something like that. Uh, if we can find one of those, we should be a lot better. And I am almost dead yet again because of these black slimes. <sighs> I don't know what it is. Oh, for goodness sake. Okay, so we now have a little bit more defense. Uh, just so we don't die immediately, hopefully. We probably will die imme still die immediately. But, I mean, at least we have a chance now. Well, hopefully anyway. Okay, once again, back to where we were. Hopefully we don't die too much, but it's not looking good so far, considering I just got hit by a dart trap. Okay, so we're roughly back to where we were last episode, if I remember correctly, before we so brutally got, well, completely destroyed my monsters. And it looks like we can at least go a little bit deeper. Yeah, there's our tombstone. Uh, looks like there's some emeralds up here, which I'm going to quickly grab. And overall, ow. Uh, we should be absolutely fine to at least go... A decent bit deeper because oh I can't see uh, there we go there we go hello boulder let's just get rid of you I don't particularly fancy you dying anymore today I imagine it'll happen though I mean I'm not amazing at this game so I don't know why I'm playing master mode since that's the case but ah that might be an issue <laughs> uh, we're just gonna take you on at range I honestly just can't see you at all. There you are. Um, and of course, there's a skeleton. Let me just see if I can just take care of you from range again. Because we are definitely not strong enough to take on a skeleton, like, close distance right now. Uh, uh, I, this is bad. This is very, very bad. Uh, let's see. Can I just attack you through here? If I can, that would be very handy. Eh. Come on. Please. Where's the hole? Oh. Oh, we've got a new sword. Hold on. 16 damage. Okay, that's a significant upgrade. We're definitely going to go for that. The range on this is awesome as well. Like, it's, it's a lot more than what we had before. So we're definitely, hopefully, not going to die too much more. But, I mean, we might as well take an iron skin potion now. We're actually down here. Uh, and at least explore, because... Oh, minecart trail. Excellent. Uh, since, since we're down here, like, the whole aim of this is just to get materials and hopefully find a suspicious-looking eye soon. Admittedly, I kind of want to take on King Slime before anything, because I know that's the easiest boss in the game, although it's master mode, so I can't really be sure of anything. Uh, I'm just going slowly just so I can put torches down when I need to. Ah, oh, crystal. Hello. And also a mother slime, which is not so hello. Uh, can I not deal with- Ah! No! No, please! No! <laughs> You're joking! <laughs> uh. <laughs> One of these days, I'm actually going to be able to take on an enemy without screaming my head off. So I just noticed, uh, we have a gravitation potion. I have a feeling you all know where this is going. Um, we also have an umbrella, so it means we hopefully won't die. Maybe? Th 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 this could go very wrong very quickly. Okay, well let's drink this potion, and then let's just sort of go upwards, I guess. Because I really want to find a floating island. Uh, that's the main reason why we're up here. So, ha having the umbrella on hand is quite handy, because it means we won't just die at all. I might actually zoom out a bit, just so we can actually see a little bit better, to see if there are any fallen islands. Okay, we're at the top, so I doubt we're going to find any up here. Uh, so let's just go down a little bit, not too far, but en enough to allow us to completely see everything around us. Hello, harpies, I don't particularly want to deal with you. Uh, oh, you do damage, you do a lot of damage. Um... Uh, no, thank you. Um, I mean, let's just heal up real quick. No. Oh, no. Th th this, th this is going horribly. Uh, let's just go down a little bit more. Uh, yeah, th that, that's, that, that's how I kind of expected it to go. 
Ah, dear, dear. Okay, well, instead of just going up to our deaths, what I think we'll do is we might expand our house a little bit because I kind of want to get some more NPCs. Uh, sorry, but yeah, let, let's just extend our house a little bit. I mean, it's looking quite small at the moment, so maybe if we build another section up here, I think that'll look very nice. Ah, well, uh, midway through building my house. Oh, hello, Pinky. Um, I'm not going to deal with you because I know you're crazy. Um, but a blood moon has just arrived, which means uh, that. Ow. Uh, this could be bad. This could be bad. Uh, I'm just going to put something in front of the door so they just can't open it. Oh no, Pinky's in the house. Pinky in the house. Uh, 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 go. No, no. <laughs> this is not what I wanted to occur. Uh, midway through working my house. And of course, the thing to occur is a blood moon of all things. Hopefully, I won't die that many times, but. I mean, we haven't died so far, and I think we've basically managed to kill this Pinky. There we go. Maybe we won't die. Uh, I, I, no, I, I'm pretty sure we're gonna die. <laughs> oh, we got a shackle, excellent. That's a little bit more defense for us, which is always good. Ah, okay, well, um, yeah, no, Scott, why? <laughs> why, Scott? Yeah, that has a lot of fallen stars though, which is nice. Um, I feel we, we Hopefully we won't die too many times though. I mean, I'm okay with dying a few times. It's just when you constantly die, then it becomes more of a challenge. It's so nice having this giant sword though. I, I love the bone sword. Like, I, 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 I think it's actually a new addition. I could be wrong though, because I don't think I've ever seen it before. But are you holding a torch? You are, aren't you? Oh, oh, oh no, 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 no. What on earth is a bloody tear? Oh, it's the blood moon. Oh, nice. I mean, that was that's supposed to be useful later on. Uh, at the moment, I think I'm just going to use my Wanda Sparking and just, you know, just rain fire from above whilst also dealing with, well, with the Dripplers with my sword. Just, just because, I mean, I don't particularly want to die too much. I'm hoping pretty soon we're going to get the nurse and hopefully the merchant too. Um, we currently have no coins in us though, so it definitely makes sense to close the door very quickly. Just hop up here, grab all these, and uh, at least attempt to survive this night. Uh, this isn't looking good. Uh, ah, ah. <laughs> yeah, I think there goes all our gold. <sighs> Well, I mean, at least we tried. We're getting a lot of fallen stars from this, though, which is very handy for uh, mage stuff. They can basically one-shot me as soon as I, uh, as soon as I respawn. That is just not going to be good for us. But I mean, the amount of fallen stars that we're getting, like, it's insane. I mean, as far as I know, we've picked up like at least ten, um, which doesn't sound like a lot now. But I mean, it's a lot of, well, it's a lot of mana stars, so. How can we can we actually make? Six. I keep forgetting how loud the mammoth crystals are. We're definitely getting there. I mean that's one way to take them out, I guess, using fallen stars. But uh Oh, that was a horrendous mistake. It's good that actually we do a little bit of knockback with the sword, because I mean whilst it's not a lot, it's enough so that we can actually take care of dripplets like this. 
Because if it wasn't, then we would we would be in a lot more trouble. Uh, although, you, you, like, we are going to be in a lot of trouble anyway, because, well, uh, these guys do a lot of damage. Especially during Blood Moon. I think, I could be wrong, but I know definitely enemy spawns are up during Blood Moons, but I'm not sure about their damage. Anyway, these Blood Zombies are looking... This looks like a, an effective strategy. Um, I have a feeling it might not work the entire night due to the dripplers, but we're, we're surviving at the very least. Also, the bride has arrived. All right, please tell me that I'm not going to die straight away to this blood zombie. Okay, I'm not. I'm going to take 50 damage every hit. Which is still basically enough to two-shot me. Uh... <laughs> if I can, I'll see if I can get that... Um, Bride zombie dead though. I mean, the vanity set is always quite nice to get. And we got a gold back at least. Uh, <laughs> I have a feeling we should probably put it in a chest, but there's currently a zombie in my house and I don't particularily want to deal with that yet. An armored shackle. Uh, can I put two shackles on? I can't actually remember. This is looking to be a problem. Uh, can I put two shackles on? I can't, but it, it's better to have that extra defense at the very least. Uh, uh, I'm just doing my best here. I'm just going to run right and hope for the best. Because uh, there is no way we can take on like blood sucklers right now. Or blood zombies even. Uh, uh, I dropped six gold in that. Oh, for goodness sake. Ah, uh, well, at least it's the morning now. And hopefully we won't die as much. We're still going to die a lot, aren't we? Ah, well, could be worse. I mean, at least we didn't die, well, too many times. I mean, we did die a lot, but it wasn't masses of deaths. Like, it could have been a lot more, uh, especially considering it's master mode. Uh, I have a feeling that went reasonably well, even though we did lose our guide. Hey, full mana already. Uh, I mean, we've got way too many mana crystals now, so uh, I'm not really sure what to do with them. But I'm going to do a little bit of reorganizing, and then I'll come back. Ah, my doors are still open. <laughs> no, bunny. Hey, we finally got the merchant. Right, where are you going to move in, mate? Uh, I don't want you to move in there. I want you to kind of move in up here, if that's fine with you. Uh, let's just talk to you. Good old forest. Right, so. So we can now get the forest pile on, which I, I don't think we'll need, really. Well, not yet, anyway. I, I mean, we're still quite early game, so... I doubt we'll need it, but I mean, the bargain might be nice to get. Um, other than that, I'm not really too sure what to get from him. Definitely the piggy bank, though. Let's definitely get the piggy bank when we get enough money. And we also got the nurse. That's going to be very, very handy. Um, I might put you in a position where I can quickly get heals from you. So maybe if I make another, another sort of house here. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. And Bradley has finally arrived. All right, well, at least we have a lot more. Did I just lose all of my silver or something? Oh, no, there it is. Just doing a little reorganizing of housing just a little bit. And I just broke my glass wall behind where I wanted to um, basically break stuff. I think that looks all right. Maybe a little bit more silver. There we go. Nice and simple. I always like decorating my houses for the NPCs just enough so that they kind of look like they're meant to be in them. Uh, what? Are you, okay, Bradley, how are you doing? Okay, nice, nice. It looks like that you're gonna like it here. Uh, I don't know why these two are both gold, but who knows, honestly. And we got the demonologist. No, not demonologist. Demolition demolitionist. I always pronounce that wrong, and I don't really know why. It, it just sort of happens. Uh, anyway, almost finished up building up the new sort of section of our house, so I'll, I'll quickly just finish organizing it, and then probably end off the episode there, because I've been playing for a little while now, and we've made a decent amount of progress. Okay, well, I can think I can safely say we made a lot of progress this episode. I have unfortunately run out of time, so I'm going to have to end it there. So thank you all so much for watching this episode of Terraria Master Mode. If you did enjoy it, please consider leaving a like down below and a comment. Uh, if you're new around here, consider subscribing to the channel. It's completely free and you're free to unsubscribe at any time at all. But apart from that, all I have left to say is see ya, take care, and bye bye